Hello? Hello? Oh. Hi. Why are you staying here? Don't you have more important things to do? I suppose you don't, given how you took the job here of all places. Anyway, as required by the company, I have to read you this introductory greeting for legal purposes. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike where fantasy and fun come to life. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage done to property or person. A missing person report will be filed in case of death or damage. The building will be bleached. I think you get it. Now then, your job is to sit here and watch over the building until 6am. I know, it sounds boring. But the animatronics do act a bit... weird at night. Because shutting off at night would leave their servos locking up, they have to roam around during the night. They're mostly safe, except for the part where if they saw you, they would think that you're a metal endoskeleton without its costume on, and try to forcefully stuff you inside of a Freddy Fazbear suit filled with crossbeams and electronics. It's a less than pleasant experience, to say the least. Oh, and the company managed to recover the puppet from one of the older locations. I'm not sure how to feel, though, as I think it's messing with the robots. They look like they tried to tear themselves apart at times. Thankfully, it happens after hours and not during the day. Here's what you can do. If the puppet or chica approach your office, shut the right door on them, using the door light to see if they're in the blind spot. For Bonnie, wear this complimentary Freddy Fazbear head we have given you. Not for too long, though, because it's kind of old and probably toxic from stuff that's gotten in it during the reconstruction of the building. Most importantly, try to conserve power. We have a small budget from just reopening, and we need to save as much as possible. Alright, I'll leave you to it. Good night.